So which of these fractions is greater, 1 fifth or 3 sixteenths? Let's see how we can figure that out. So the first thing we need to do, we need to find a denominator for both of these fractions that's the same, have a common denominator. Then we compare the numerators and we'll know if 1 fifth is greater than 3 sixteenths or 3 sixteenths is greater than 1 fifth. Probably the best way to do that would be to take 5 and multiply it by 16. So if I do that, I end up with 80. And then down here, I could multiply 16 by 5, and that would give me 80 as well. And now I have a denominator that's the same. So I get the numerator, compare those, figure out which is greater. I can't just multiply the denominator by 16 here. I need to multiply the numerator by 16 as well. And that's because 16 divided by 16 that's just 1. So I'm multiplying by 1, and I don't change the value, just the way it's represented. 1 times 16 is 16. And 16 eightieths is equivalent to 1 fifth. They have the same value. Down here, 3 times 5 over 5, that's 15 over 80. Now, since the denominator is the same, we can compare the numerators. When we do that, we see that 16 is greater than 15, so 16 80ths is greater than 15 80ths. Not by a lot, but it is greater. That means that 1 fifth, that's greater than 3 16ths, because 1 fifth is the same as 16 80ths, and 3 16ths is the same as 15 80ths. That's how you do it. This is Dr. B comparing the fractions 1 fifth and 3 16ths. Turns out that 1 fifth is just a little bit bigger. Thanks for watching.